Welcome to the new section where we will first get familiar with the user interface that Microsoft Project offers. Before you start creating project schedules like a pro, it is important that you understand the functionality of the tool itself. On this screen, you will see the various features of the interface. This screen may look intimidating to a new user because of the number of buttons and controls, but this is very natural and one should not fear. As over the next few videos, I will walk you through all aspects of the interface and make you familiar and comfortable with it. So uh, let us look at them one by one. Microsoft Fluent Interface, also known as the Ribbon, if you have used any Microsoft Office products like Word or Excel, you would already be familiar with this interface. Quick Access Toolbar. This is a customizable toolbar similar to those found on Internet Explorer and similar products. As the name suggests, this is designed to give you rapid access to the commands that you use the most. Mini Toolbar and Contextual Menu. This is accessed by right-clicking at different locations on the interface. Options on this menu will change dynamically depending on the context where you right click. The status bar. By default, the status bar includes a task mode for new tasks control, quick links to the Gantt chart, task usage, team planner, resource sheet views, reports, and zoom control. Right clicking on the status bar brings up a contextual menu which shows several other options. Backstage. When you click on the File tab, notice that this tab is in a different color. You enter what is called by Microsoft as the Backstage view. Here you have commands and controls to manage file operations and also manage options for controlling behavior of Microsoft Project itself. We will look into all of these features in depth in the following lectures of this section.